Let me check this thing out. I hope you enjoyed that little clip. I don't know what that was. I'm not going to be honest with you. How I pictured it in my head probably is not how it's going to come out when y'all see it. But anyways, um, got a new video, of course. Why else would you be here if it wasn't a new video? I got a new bag, people. Um, in this bag, I actually just went to the pro shop and they actually had it. And they were like, you know, I ordered it for somebody, but they didn't want it. So, it's been sitting here. I see you're a motive guy. And he's seen that I had a motive bag and he's seen that, you know, most everything I have is motive. And he was just like, we got a bag if you, if you would like to pay for it, of course. Uh, you know, of course I said, sure, why not? Just got paid, so rack up a check. And uh, I went to this pro shop. I had to take a long drive to go to it because the one that I've been going to, had to try something different. Let's just say I had to try something different. Not going to downplay them. Just had to try something different. So the bag that I got is the So the bag that I got is the Motive Bag the Vault. Um as you can see uh, Motive right here. And this is a triple bag roller. I'm not sure. It is the it is the toughest thing to find these things. And if you find them, they are like 200 a pop. Um, there are some sites that are cheaper, but let me tell you. Whew. And from what I can see right now, um, I still haven't really looked at this bag. It is a very nice bag, big. I'm here because. I'm going to show you what's inside my bag. Of course, I got my uh, my KR Strike Force uh, Tornit um, shoes. Of course, I don't have really much in here. Actually, this is about a boom ball. I'm not even going to lie to you. But then I have my purple chamois, motor chamois that I just found. And then I don't have none of my tape or. Uh, Grip tape or any of that in here yet, but what I do have is three bowling balls in here, and we're not worried about one of them because we all know that is my forge flare. But two of them, y'all have not. Well, one of them you've seen, but the other one you have not. So, um, like I said, we've got my. Uh, Forge flare. In case y'all want to see how that is drilled, that's how I got it drilled. Wait, that's how I got it drilled. There you go. The pencil this time. I forgot. I don't know. It just it throws me off too. I can't even. I don't know how many times I picked a bone and just went like this, and I'm like, oh wait, don't go. Now we're good. So, yep. Uh, my forge flare. Sad, sad, sad to see it go, you know, no longer in the mode of lineup. Uh, it is a retired ball now. Thank God I got got this gym. I love this thing. Then we have my Jackal Ghost. Um, and let me tell you, I love this ball also. Um, even though I just threw it today after it got drilled, as you can see pin down layout. Um, I love this thing. I truly love this thing. Last but not least, the thing that I've been waiting for and I'm so happy to finally have in my arsenal and can't wait to throw this thing in Vegas and in the league and I have the motive mythic 
jackal. Look at that beautiful, I mean the teal, the black, the, the bronze or golden jackal logo. And then you got that, uh, that bronze right here. I guess you call that a gold jackal uh, logo. And of course it is a pearl ball, my goodness. And that is the layout that I got pinned down. Also again, I'm starting to really like pin down layouts, not no lie, and let me tell you, not the ball. It took a while to understand it, but once you get it, you get it. I got this one faster than I got that one. Let me tell you. Oh, it just, uh, yes. I have been waiting. I ordered this in, when did they announce it? I think I ordered it like three weeks after they announced it and finally got it uh, the 11th. They shipped it out on the 9th. Of course, that's when they released it and got it on the 11th. Now they're trying to rack my money with the blue coral venom, but I'm gonna have to wait on that one because I don't know about that yet. So we're gonna chill out and just rock with the jackals and the forge flares. My God, and I'm gonna give y'all a little tour of the bag too, since that. But yes, this is my new ball in the arsenal. Um, but let's go ahead and give you a little bit of a tour of the bag. Why don't we? All right, so simply put, there you have the normal bag right here. Then on this side, don't mind the socks, you know, got the Goku uh, socks, got the uh, Dragon Ball Z socks, more like it. Um, like I said, it's a triple bag roller. Um, got a nice big, the vault, well, big vault. I don't know why I can't want to say it, the vault. The vault logo with the motive logo right there. Then you have a nice little three pouches with a nice little secure uh, Velcro strap on top of each one to secure that ball nice and tight in there. Uh, and then right here you have Motive on the side with a pouch, nothing in it yet. Nice little two year warranty card. Gotta activate that. Then right here, I guess this is a pouch that you could put in like your Avalon pads, your grit pads, true grit, um, whatever you use pads in there. Um, and then on the other side, on the other side, I'm doing this upside down, so if it's bad angle, I'm sorry. Outside, just a long uh, pocket that you can use, you know? Just whatever you put in there, your cleaning supplies, because that's what I'm about to do to my balls right now. Use, you know, some clean, power clean gel. Um, and uh, yeah, that's the video. Um, this is kind of awkward, I'm not gonna lie to you. Um, yes, it is a late night video, of course. You know, I love doing my videos late night, especially at nine in the morning. Like, comment. Um, and next video I think you're gonna like because uh, you're gonna see me throw the jackal ghost and the mythic jackal. So stay tuned.